how do we carry social class in our bodies? How does it get under our skin? As you go through being relatively poor, having job insecurity, all of those things will decrease control over people's lives, and all of those things are likely to increase risk of illness. And there are good biological reasons why that might be the case. When we feel threatened or don't have control in our lives, one critical biological reaction kicks in, the stress response. When the brain perceives a threat, it signals the adrenal glands to release potent stress hormones, among them cortisol. They flood your bloodstream with glucose, increase your heart rate, raise blood pressure. They put your body on alert. Cortisol improves memory, it enhance, enhances immune function, uh, it, it helps you reestablish energy supplies. Mother Nature put all of this stuff in there to help us survive. Stress helps to motivate us. In our society today, everybody experiences stress. In fact, the person who has no stress is the person who's dead. A normal stress response spikes up when needed, then turns off. But what happens when pressures are relentless and you lack the power and resources to control them? when the stress response stays turned on for months or years. These systems begin to work overtime. We produce too much cortisol. Chronically, cortisol can impair immune function. It can actually inhibit memory and even cause areas of the brain to shrink. When you get prolonged activation of these stress pathways, they in turn affect heart rate variability the ability to handle insulin and glucose. And those, in turn, we think, increase risk of diabetes and heart disease. Because of the stresses and the wear and tear on the body systems, it's reflected ultimately in higher rates of disease and accelerated aging. In our society today, everybody experiences stress. However, in many disadvantaged communities, what we have is the accumulation of multiple negative stressors. And it's so many of them, it's as if someone has been hit from every single side. And it's not only that they're dealing with a lot of stress, they have few resources to cope. 